So that's all about the curl command. So far we have discussed how to execute the APIs and uh, respective tests by executing manually one by one all the APIs, right? So if we are having uh, 100 APIs, so we will be executing one by one all the APIs. So that will be more time consuming, right? So let's discuss how to execute the whole collection at one shot. So you can select this collection and you can click on three dots and after that you can select the option as run collection. So here on the left side you will see the all the API requests which are there inside the your collection. So on the right side you will find the data. So you can select the data file if we are performing the data driven testing. And right now we are not performing any data driven testing. So we will discuss this concept a bit later. So simply you can click on run booking API. So that's it. So execution got completed. So here you can see the one column called duration. So here you will find the total time taken for this entire execution and another column you can see here all tests. So we have total 15 test assertions. So coming down here in this all tests tab you will find all the test that is a API request and respective details. So if you look at here one of the API this is the get API. So this is a request name and followed by the URL. So this is where exactly this API is present. This is a path of the API. Then we are getting the status code and after that we are getting the response time of the server. Then finally, so this is nothing but the response body plus response headers total size. So that's brief about the execution summary result and also you can click on this past. So in this section, you will find all the past API, API and respective test assertions. And you can click on this field. If there is any failed tests, so you will find it here. And also you can click on this view summary. So here you will find each API wise uh, respective how many tests are there or how many assertions are there. Now I will discuss how to execute the any specific folder API request.